it's so odd when people use the word pretentious for different forms of art. Like, all art is subjective. You either like it or you don't like it. But just to, like, use these sorts of words for things, like, it seems to just be whenever something has concepts in it that are a little odd, whenever things just use, like, something fresh, something new, a new perspective on things, like, whoa, this is interesting. Like, people would probably say it about the Matrix trilogy, about Ghost in the Shell, about Blade Runner, Blade Runner 2049, some of my favorite things. And a lot of people would probably be like, oh, you just watch them because you think you're smart or something. It's like, I just think these are amazing concepts and, like, great movies, great stories being told. I just, I've always really liked ever since I learned of what it is and everything, like just futuristic, cyberpunk, post-apocalyptic, different things like that. I love that whole, you know, corporate greed and pollution and different things, like just seeing like a world, being a little bit afraid of the future, that's a healthy thing to have. And I think that's an important concept to use in different things, like just to remind like, hey, we need some changes or look what could happen. And I'm not saying we're gonna be fighting with machines and stuff. I'm just saying there are all sorts of cool ideas out there, and I like to have that warning of, like, what corporate greed and just not listening to the uh, voices that protect the forests and everything, like, what that could lead to. But anyway, so many different things. I thought, uh, I heard the same thing about, um... Annihilation. I thought that that was a really trippy, strange movie, but so many people would be like, uh would just say, yeah, th that's the same. I'd just be like, talk about how like, oh, it's so like pseudo whatever, intelligent, like garbage, like everybody likes different things. It's like just to bash what you don't like. How about you just focus on what you do like, find the things you love rather than being like, oh, everybody thinks they're so smart because they like this or like, or you're stupid for liking this. It's like, Everybody likes different things. That's what's wonderful. Everybody has different tastes. It's a beautiful thing. So, like, when I see reviews on different things, different artists, you know, for albums or, like, uh, it could be any form of art. It could be labeled pretentious or uh, or just, like, too simple or, like, stupid or whatever. It's like, celebrate the diversity in art. There's so much beautiful art out there. I mean so much weird stuff and like just to like make that's assumptions that's called making assumptions when you like think that somebody likes something to appear a certain way most people aren't like that most people aren't actors trying to be like oh i wonder what people think about me so i'm gonna like post this no most people are truly who they want to be and want to find like-minded people like them that like similar things who truly like what they like, love what they love, are super excited about new things related to the things that they love. Like, that whole assumption that people are trying to put on, you know, an act and appear a certain way for certain people. Maybe, like, you are, but most of us truly love what we love and we're honest people. And still, I just think, I mean, there's, you know, it's inevitable to just have judgment from people. There are going to be some people that judge and be like, oh, you like that. I can't believe you like that. You probably just think you're smart. I don't. I do not think that I'm exceptionally intelligent. I really don't. I, you know, everybody, there's so many forms of intelligence and like forms of, you know, even some knowledge is just memorization. So many things are just like, oh, you're able to memorize things well, so that means you can do things well. It's like there are so many forms of intelligence outside of that with pattern recognition and different things, all sorts of forms. And I'm not saying that I'm, that I excel in any of them. I think I'm a pretty average guy, except for my, I do have some shortcomings uh, with socialization and different things. I'm not average in every way. I do have my issues, but, um, uh, I have some very unlucky issues, so that sucks, but, uh, hey, keep going. Things are good. Anyway, just love what you love. Be true to who you are. Be fully yourself and fuck what people think. Like, try to find people that are like you and, you know, just disregard people that try to put down your work or, like, the work that you consume. Because it's all good. 
there's all sorts of stuff. If you like Call of Duty, you fucking like Call of Duty. There's nothing wrong with that. It's not like, oh, typical garbage or whatever. Some people like Call of Duty. So fucking what? If you like fucking Cyberpunk 2077 or whatever, own that shit. You like it. Like, it doesn't matter. Like what you like. Life is short. Do what you really like. Take care of yourself and have good times when you're able to. I love you all.